Okay, hello and welcome to another video on my channel. Today I'm going to do a tutorial on how to download mods to Kerbal Space Program. So, at first I want you to um, open up your Google Chrome or Firefox or I don't know what, you, what you're using. You'll just search engine and you type in KSP mods. And then you go into this website called CurseForge, which is a, I don't know, it's kind of like a community website where you can download mods to different games and stuff. And here you've got loads of different mods. I don't know how many, 45 different pages of just KSP mods. So let's do uh, all versions and then sort by last updated. So that means it's compatible with uh, the uh, what do you say the current update on your client. So let's see here what mod do we want to download? Near uh, Kerbal reusability expansion. Let's do that. Landing gear, grid fins, and more. So you can open this up. And you can read the comments and stuff and here you've got some screenshots so you've got okay you can't open the picture but there are different landing gears there and you press download download here the orange button download press that and it will take a few seconds and in the bottom corner here in the bottom left you'll get this uh, zip file and you open that okay and then you've got the mod here you can yeah and uh, maybe it says game data or something before then you just go into game data until you find the the name of the mod and uh, okay so now when we've got the mod uh, like this we can uh, Go into library, okay, and then right, cri right click on the Kerbal Space Program, and go into properties, then go into local files, and press browse local files, okay. Now that came over to my sec second screen, and I'll just do it like that. Then you go into game data, and then here I've got all my mods, okay, but you'll just have the flags and the squad here or maybe only the squad and then you um, then you just take a Kerbal reusability expansion and you just drag it in there and because I've already got this I'll just um, overwrite these this is in Swedish but yeah this means overwrite the, f um, the files um, so I'll just press that but it will do it automatically if you haven't got it and then you just uh, start your Kerbal Space Program play and uh, I'll see you when uh, the game is started Okay, we're back. So now when we're in Kerbal Space Program, I'll just go into uh, Already Saved World, YouTube Video Numero Uno. And I'll go into that one, and I'll load for a bit. I can hear the birds in the background. Now, <coughs> are we going to the uh, Vehicle Assembly Building, the VAB? Here, and let's just uh, take uh, one of these. Yeah, one of these larger. Uh, should I use? Yeah, this one. Okay. Make Kerberdyne. Yeah, 
this is the right one. Okay, and I'll just uh, do like a massive booster thing. Uh, where's the Rocker Max? Rocker Max Jumbo. There. And I'll do the Alt trick. So just hold down Alt and press the part that you want to copy. And you've got it here without having to do copy paste. Because when you do like auto strat and then now I do copy paste. Uh, oh wait. If I now do this, or this, or this, and then I do control Z, then the auto strat goes away. Which is bad. <laughs> so now when I've just got this booster, I'll add like a Cell. Main cell. Where's the main cell? There. I'll have one of those. Then I'll take a few of these FLT 400s and just move. No, put them 45 degrees there. I'll rotate it like that and I'll move it in change the color of it so this is just gonna work as a um, what do you say just as a structural part to um, put the uh, landing legs Now, here in the landing legs, we've got these really neat looking things. Well, I don't think I actually need this. Falcon small landing gear. Um, Falcon landing gear small. This one. Let's just rotate these. to use the medium ones. Like that. And I can move the engine up. Like that. And I'll just put some kind of nose cone on it. Batteries, maybe on battery. A couple of reaction wheels. Um, I use my modded RCS thrusters, which use liquid fuel and uh, um, liquid, liquid fuel and uh, liquid ox liquid oxygen. So. Um, these will work as my SAS, no, uh, RCS control. And then I'll just put a nose cone on here. Uh, like that. And I'll just auto strap these for maximum safety. <laughs> um, like that. And I'll just add a few fins here, like that. Okay, so um, that's how you um, download a uh, a uh, a mod. It's quite simple. You can build this kind of rocket. I see that the um, particles doesn't don't want to work. Now, um, that's a bit weird. And I can steer this. 
do some RCS controlling and I turn off the engines I forgot to add the grid fins that you also that were um, included in this mod and I can ignite the engine full power then turn it down to two thirds and I can deploy the landing gear like this So that's how you um, download a mod, it's really simple, you can do it with uh, any other mod, you can download this uh, MechJeb that I saw here, MechJeb, Autopilot, Information Displays. Yeah, so I hope you um, found this interesting, and I hope you can get some use out of it. So, um, I'll see you in the next one.